In a previous video, we did a sentiment analysis for stocks on Reddit using a Python script. In this video, our challenge is to adapt this script to make it work for cryptocurrencies. If we succeed, we can just push a button and have two nice graphs with the top crypto picks and bullish bearish recommendations. And if we fail, we'll have to do this analysis manually, which takes a lot of time and is very error prone. I hope we don't have to do this. If you don't know me, I'm Julian and on my channel, I explain blockchain technology. Sentiment analysis is a technique using machine learning to analyze the emotion that are expressed in the text. We're going to use this on crypto subreddits to find out what's the mood of the market regarding the main cryptocurrencies. It's going to work like this. So we start with our subreddit and we are going to select a couple of posts. We're going to focus on posts that specifically discuss trading. Then in this post, we are going to filter the comments that are the most upvoted. Then for each of these comments, we are going to run our sentiment analysis algorithm. So this will use what we call a lexicon. This is basically a dictionary where we attach each word to a value. This will help us to extract the emotion that are expressed in the text. And after that, for each comment, we're going to associate a ticker of crypto to a value. If this is positive, it means that the mood is bullish, otherwise it's bearish. So we're going to do this for each comment individually. And at the end, we're going to calculate the average for each crypto so that we can know the mood of the whole market. To do our sentiment analysis, we need to have a list of all the crypto tickers that we want to analyze. So first, I check out the API of CoinMarketCap and they do have an endpoint for this, but we have to create an API key. So after I check out the API of CoinGecko and we don't need to create an API key, so it's a little bit more convenient. So I tried a first endpoint coins slash list, but it returns absolutely all the coins that are supported by CoinGecko total, they are 16,000. It's way too much and there is no way to filter them. So I check out another endpoint coins markets and this one is paginated and you can also order by the biggest market cap. So I decided to use this endpoint. Then I created a script to download all the tickers from this endpoint. So I'm going to show you quickly how it work. So here, this is where we download all the tickers. So the endpoint is paginated. It written 250 crypto for each request maximum. So total, we're going to do 10 requests to get 2,500 crypto. So here you can see the URL of the endpoint. So what's important here is that for the order, you specify that you want in market cap descending and per page, we want 250, which is the maximum. And then this is cut off on my screen, but we have end page and specify which page we want. And here the I, so this is what we call a F string in Python. It's going to be dynamically replaced by the I here of the for loop. So one, two, three, four, five, etc., up to 10. And so here in each iteration of our loop, we're going to fetch the list of crypto. Then we're going to transform the data into a JSON object. And then for each crypto that is returned, we are going to append to a string. So that's what we do here. So at the end, we're going to have something like this, like BTC, Ether, etc. And after that, we're going to inject all these tickers into a template and we will dynamically create a Python file this way. We are going to render a template and here pass it our tickers like this. And then we are going to save the result in a file called data.py. And I'm going to show you what the template looks like, data.jinja. So here, basically, the content of the ticker string is going to be replace here so at the end we're gonna have a very long dictionary and for the rest of the template is just gonna be copy pasted in the final output 
So here, very important new words. So we are going to enrich the lexicon for our sentiment analysis. So here, for example, if we see Lembo in the comment, this is positive, Rect is very negative, Hodl slightly positive, FOMO very positive, etc. Okay, so I'm going to run this script. So first, we are going to activate our virtual environment. Then you need to install the dependency with pip install recursive requirements. I've already done it before. And after we are going to run our script, get tickers. And after, if you open data.py, then here you can see that our crypto dictionary has been filled with all the tickers, Bitcoin, Ether, etc. And if you want to update this dictionary from time to time, you just have to rerun the script. To set the parameters of our analysis, we are going to open the main file, reddit sentimentanalysis.py. So first, we need to set the client ID and client secret for the connection to Reddit. So for this, you need to create an account on Reddit and go to this URL. It's to manage your application. And you going to create a new application. You select script. You need to give it a redirect URL. You can give it whatever URL, it doesn't matter. You create the app and after you will see this in your app list. And this is your client ID and this is your client secret. So you copy paste this here and after we have a few more parameters so you need to select which crypto subreddit you want to analyze so cryptocurrency is the biggest one but you also have some others like crypto markets for example after you need to select what's the title of the post that we're going to analyze so daily discussion that's where people discuss trading in cryptocurrency subreddit then the next important parameter is the upvote ratio. So we're only going to select posts that have much more upvote than downvote. Then we want to see 20 upvote minimum. And this is for the number of comments that we want to analyze. This is number of minimum upvote for the comment. Then the number of crypto pick that you want, so 10. And here the number of crypto that you want to use for the sentiment analysis. And that's it. So I'm not going to explain the rest of the script because I already did this in my other video on the sentiment analysis of Wall Street Bets. You can check it out on my channel. So next, we're going to run our script. run the script you go to the root of the project and you run your terminal python reddit sentiment analysis press enter and you will need to wait a couple of minutes so be patient and we have the result so let's see what we have here 10 most mentioned peak so bitcoin so at the moment bitcoin is booming so it's normal ether is also doing really well ave ada yes so cardano is also pumping a lot and if you close this you're going to see the sentiment analysis for the top five peaks so here you can see for bitcoin so green represent bullish and red bearish and the other green neutral and so what you're looking for is something like ADA where you have a lot of bullish a lot of bullish and very little bearish next you can play with the parameters of the script and see how it changes the analysis you can also add some other subreddits for that you will need to customize the way we select the post to include in the analysis, for example, on the cryptocurrency subreddit, we filter posts called daily discussion, but on other subreddits, it might be weekly discussion or some other name. Check out my other video on sentiment analysis for stocks using the Wall Street Bet subreddit. And I also have a trading boat for Bitcoin. It's a cool little project. I'll see you there.